Hello everyone. Good morning, good evening, good afternoon wherever you are. Welcome to my YouTube channel. So in today's video, we will be watching the behind the scenes of this beautiful kinky gown. So, stay tuned. Get it right into it. I always make sure that my kinty aligns are the way how I would love them to align. So I try my best to, you know, align it for it to follow a specific pattern. And this section, it was a mermaid type. So this is the organza that would be beneath the mermaid. And this was when I was actually making sure I get a measurement for the flare and here in this section i was trying to get the exact measurement where i will be applying my hard net in order to give that puffy nature beneath the mermaid that i was sewing so here i was cutting the hard nets in this section i did some calculations and that was the calculations i used to actually get that measurement and then actually worked around it you know so here in this section i was also making sure i was cutting a flare yeah it was a slanted flare and funny enough here in ghana it is actually called my cruise because there was this dress in that my cruise movie that you know the lady was always wearing that slanted flare so it actually got that it became famous for that actually because of the lady so it's actually called my cruise here in ghana funny enough but it was actually a slanted flare and i had to make sure that i was aligning it because it was slanted flare i didn't want to waste any kinti i don't want to waste kinti kinti are fabrics i really don't want to waste you can't waste like why do you even have to waste the fabric so i did my cutting on the brown paper to make sure that i get the measurements i needed and then i wanted to get the slanted flare how i wanted it to be and this is what you can see me doing so here in this section i had actually done the cutting and i was attaching the organza the flare to the skirt as you can see here that was what i was doing here in this section yep 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 if you would love us to actually work on your kinty gown kindly send me a message i will be leaving the link in the bio i mean the description sorry so kindly do so this was this down section so the down was finally complete have you seen how the patterns are aligning this is what i was talking about okay this was what i was talking about here in this section i was dealing with the upper part of it you know the corset came to the upper sections so i was i actually always make sure i do my cutting on patterns like i mean brown paper when the need arises especially when it comes to kinte here i was doing the sewing and i was making sure that it was going to get snatched at i wanted it to get snatched so here in this section i was making sure i was cutting all the threads i always try my best to make sure i cut all the threads that was how it was looking have you seen the breast yes 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 and this is it bead and spin is basically in stock if you would love to purchase some kindly send me a message on whatsapp i will be leaving the link in the description so that i get to deliver it to you wherever you are payment before delivery yep 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 so we are in this section it was a beading section so i actually had to get my bead and spin and it helps me to achieve you know beading like i get to bead more in the shortest possible time is extremely efficient it helps me like really manage my time positively and it's just so amazing how this cute adorable machine can basically help you achieve a lot in the shortest duration so here in this section i was doing the beading and the beading tutorials has already been uploaded on the channel okay so i will be leaving it in the description as well and it would be on the cards as well so stay alert i already have the video uploaded last week and this is the behind the scenes of it so this is how it was looking like so this was when she came in for the first fitting you know i think this was the first and the last i make sure i completed everything there was that she had to do and all the stuff like that so i continued the beading after all the alteration that had to be done the stitches and everything so i continued up with the you know the beading that is very very necessary so that was what i was doing here in this section so here yeah, i was following a specific pattern with my so this is the 
final 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 garment this was how the whole project was looking like and this is like just as what she wanted and this is exactly what we delivered so this is what she got at the end of the day so if you are loving this video kindly give us a thumbs up and then subscribe for more amazing videos like this but hey don't forget to watch our videos all the time because we upload videos every week so stay alert don't forget to subscribe and like kisses xoxo